I'm saying, well, Jumal, but yeah, yeah, how Ghana Hanum. Nanka bind in the family of Quine Soo, and so, Sino Hydro deal, ah, bind Saka, Effy China, and see, and I bind with Giano. Nasasam, we are NDC for a dear champion, or my car can't 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 can not can not can not can not can not can not the exact figures dealing with them as per particular nationals cannot be given now. But the nationals that have been deported include Chinese, Indians, Nigerians, Malians, and Burkinabis. So it is not only Chinese that have been deported. Neither is it only Aisha one that has been deported for purposes of Sino-Hydro loan or purposes of Sino-Hydro agreement that the government of Ghana has with the Chinese government. And we did not sacrifice her or exchange her for the loan. This lady was in Ghana prior to the arrangement that we made with the Chinese government to secure the financial assistance from them. And no government official thought of shielding her. No government official pampered her. There is nobody in the MPP that dreamt of dealing with Aisha in one way or the other so that she can perpetrate the illegal mining she was found in doing in Ghana so as to enable Ghana to secure the loan from Chinese government. We are talking of a number of excavators that have come into the government's hands as a result of the work of Operation Vanguard, making all effort to stop illegal miners on the ground. And we are now alluding to the fact that we have 300 excavators in our hands as same have been seized, confiscated from the illegal miners on the ground. And that is an achievement of government for purposes of stopping illegal mining when the ban was in place. Either it was in the form of small scale mining that had been banned or in the form of Galamse. And it will not be wrong on the part of the ministry or the government to ascribe a particular body to assist the ministry in doing investigation or trying to put what is not right in the sector to a proper perspective as being done by others somewhere. You see that when you go to the grounds, you find people doing this illegal mining. The sector is so big to the extent that you need more hands to assist in this direction. The Interministerial Committee on Illegal Mining did not come in a vacuum. It came as a result of the ill that people were perpetrating on the ground, destroying our water bodies, causing environmental degradation, devastation to the soil, using mercury here and there, causing diseases to most of us. And the government thought it prudent to have another body under the Ministry of Lands and Natural Resources to assist in averting all such bad circumstances. KJTI Jackass here, I see our Asante Mantam Michel Kumaseno, a doom jack in your phone, a day, doom jam for the other donor, a position, said a bear, a to rent him, but he said a jashe in it here, and when we are one bit to me, a son who are bread and cover or your nebia ever. Now, no, I don't mind doom japan in pie, a year or a edwin, a co blankson, a casa homo, the other dress, as they say, the bibia than a quemo, a wo a jashe, and any honky kayahoo, a wo kjt jackass anymore. Chief Fire Officer, Edema Ghana National.